six. Anderson pulls it in. Chicago leading by four. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. McDermott's checked in for money. Good ball movement. One minute now into this fourth quarter. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials on the contact, and he'll shoot two. Yeah, he got whacked. Shouldn't be much debate on that one. Yeah, that was as straightforward as it gets, guys. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Rajon Rondo's checked in for Boston. And Rose drops them both. Well, you can count on him, can't you? He seems to knock down free throws consistently all game long. The dish to Bradley. Wallace kicks to run. It's Bradley on the wing. A three ball. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Noah's got five rebounds tonight. Clark, this offense has really been clicking. No doubt about it, giving the defense all kinds of trouble. And they're playing with so much energy offensively. The ball is really moving. Hard work and soft hands, guys. That's what made that play possible. No simple offensive rebound there. Going for the tip in. But that's the way you've got to go. If you, you know, if you have good position, you've got to get after it and go for that second chance opportunity. Here's Middleton to end the run, and he lays it up and in. Chicago leading by six. Rose dishes to Noah. Yes, and it's Rose with the assist that time. Rose has got his third assist on the night. For Boston, they've gone one of three from the field to start the fourth quarter. Rose against Rondo. Outside Brent. Ball's knocked loose and stolen by Butler. Here we go, one on one. Rose gets the bucket. He's been a different guy in the second half, guys. His shooting percentage far better than it was before the break. Celtics making a switch here. Sullinger's checked in. Money's checked in for the Bulls. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. Hey, guys. Well, Brad Stevens had some advice for the team over that last break. He was riding them pretty hard for the number of silly fouls they've committed in this game. He said, listen, we need to have some defensive discipline. Stop biting on the shot fakes, stop reaching in, and stop giving them free points at the free throw line. We'll see if they'll respond, guys. Pass to Noah. McDermott gets to Gasol. On the left block, can't hit. And the Celtics going the other way now. They owes the Kings after this game. That game will conclude a three-game homestand. And you know for the Kings, that's a game they'd really like to have. What a finish with that hoop. The Bulls leading by eight. Outside Rose. And we're about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter. Henderson against Brad. Henderson, no good. For Boston, they've gone two for five on field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. The shot by Sellinger, wide open. Good. And it's Rondo who picks up the assist. Rondo's got his fourth assist in this one. For Chicago, they've gone four of seven from the field since the beginning of the fourth. Rondo against Rose. Here's Noah. And Boston with the rebound. 
Zellinger's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And there's the basket. Whistle blows and a chance for a three-point play. Going to the line for one. His shooting has been so good today. He may have to take it upon himself to try to get his club out of this hole. You look at what Bradley has done so far. He has nine points. And he's chalked up one three-pointer on the day as well. Now, a lot of times, he's one of those players who can get hot and stay hot from the three-point line. So I look for him to continue to some shots out there. 151 left in the game. The try by Rondo. The tray. And the winner gets it to go on the assist by Rondo. Now, just a one-point Bulls lead. So here is Chicago. They've led by as much as 10. McDermott gets a screen from Henderson. Henderson with the screen for McDermott. Henderson with a screen on Bradley. McDermott passes to Rose. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Rose has got nine points in the quarter. 129 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Bradley gets to Middleton. Dishes to Sullinger. It's good coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. 11 points for Jared Sullinger. Well, they found the touch here in the second half from the field. And everything else we talk about, folks, rebounding, defense, all of that, this game is still about making shots. You got to put the ball in the basket. That's the bottom line. And they found a way to do it here in the second half. And the crowd roaring to life. That was a huge shot. And they're just about dancing in the aisles now. What an eruption in this building. Rose kicks to McDermott. He dishes it to Henderson. Rose passes to Henderson. Bradley with some nice D. Not too much congestion in the lane. I think he could have gotten a better shot that time. No question. The drive by Rondo. Feeds it to Middleton to take the lead. Tries again. Well, Sullinger has been great. 11 rebounds, and he's also got one block to add to the mix today. Yeah, it's just a small part of what's been a, a solid overall contribution by him defensively. And so both free throws are good, and it's a two-point ball game. Nicely done. Without much separating these teams, that's when you have to make good at the line. Throws off the bit from Henderson. To the wing on the left. Noah dishes to Henderson. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Offside Gasol. Six to shoot. Henderson with a screen on Bradley. Here's Rose. Oh, no good. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. That's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. Yep, you got to extend the game here. Try to keep that clock from moving. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. Henderson with the screen for Rose. And they tie. Hands it to force overtime. Gets the big time shot to fall, and we are headed to overtime. Regulation is ended, and we're heading to overtime. And we'll return shortly. Need more than that, son. Doing what I can, coach. That basketball action, this one has been a great one. Overtime number one. Getting going right now. Courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineup for us now in overtime. So for Chicago right now, D. Rose and Jimmy Butler, the back. Inside at the four and five are Gasol and Noah. And it's McDermott in at the three. Balanced scoring, Clark and Steve, for them. They're moving it well. Yeah, you love to see teams share the sugar. Everybody getting yeah. a touch. Everybody enjoying an opportunity to score. That makes a lot of fun for everybody on the court. You yes. know, it sounds better when you say it than watching it. Okay? <laughs> I like better when you say it. Sharing the sugar. Well, right, Steve? <laughs> yeah, pass the cream, too. I mean, while you're at it. I mean, this has been something to watch. I mean, it's just everybody getting involved. Butler kicks to Gasol. Rebound by Owenick. Oh, Linux got six rebounds in the game. This game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding is one thing that they've been able to, to dominate. Yeah, they've chased down that pumpkin off. Smart with the ball, working on Rose. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Really good work defensively. This coach has to be happy with his team. Yeah, forcing that miss right there, great effort. 
Here's Gasol. Nice shot from 10 feet out. Gasol's got the game tied up here for the Bulls. And they got exactly what they wanted against that defense. In overtime here, a minute and a half off the clock. Now here's Smart. Right wing. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will take Bulls have gone one of three from the floor since the start of overtime. Rose kicks to McDermott. Yes, and it's Rose with the assist that time. And now it's a three-point Chicago lead. The Celtics shooting straight 49% from the field. Pass to Olenek, stolen by Noah. Outside Rose. Noah, the pass to McDermott. The feet to Rose. Butler against Bradley. Shot clock at five. Here's Gasol. Connects! Well, he knew that with his height advantage over his man, it was really a good decision just to rise up and take the jump shot. Gasol with the steal. And there's the foul to try to stop the break, and that'll be a clear path to the basket. Two free throws coming up, and they'll retain possession. What a game for Rose. He has 17 points, and he's done a good job distributing the ball as well. Well, you can't discount what that's meant to this team. I mean, he's helped their cause with his passing, and it's really given his team a nice groove. Good on the first, and that increases their lead to six. So he goes two for two. Henderson. Stroke at the free throw line right there. Money's checked in for Chicago. Just under two and a half minutes passed here in this overtime. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. throw is good and that stretches their lead to eight second one is good Hitting both at the line, and it's a nine-point ball game here. And that's exactly how you close a game out. Those free throws will bury them for sure. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Dishes it to Sullinger. Kicks to Middleton. Bradley against Henderson. Bradley drives in. Gasol with the block. It's going to be a tough loss to swallow. They just didn't have much gas left in the tank once we got to overtime. Outside Rose. And so it's Chicago winning this one. You know, Clark, they couldn't put him away in regulation, but after a superb performance in overtime, they managed to get the job done. Yeah, just an amazing game, but they pulled away at the end. And a chance now to send you over to Doris Burke standing by on the sideline. Doris? Well, pal, congratulations on the win here. How satisfying is this victory for you and the team? It's satisfying just because we got a great, another great win. And the way we've been playing lately, is, it's been, I think it's just been great. Uh, and we just got to keep the momentum going. Wins help the confidence, pal. Congratulations. Guys, back to you. Thank you, Doris. That'll do it for now. For Doris Burke, Steve Curran, Clark Kellogg, and the rest of the 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for joining us.